Hey guys, welcome back to Life With Love. This is your girl Love and I am back with another Fragrance Friday video. Another fragrance video, guys. So hopefully you guys enjoyed my last uh, video, which was a haul. Um, I went to Target, Nordstrom Rack, um, Zara, and I believe one other place. But I just got some goodies. Literally forgot two of the items in that video to shoot with. Of course I would forget. But anyway, I am back with another video today. So, before I get started, I want to say that this top is available over on lovedavis.com. Now, it is a winter top, so it's limited in stock, but it's still one of my favorite ribbed sweaters, and I just love it. I pulled it out um, because it's a bit of a chilly day today, so I was like, oh, let me just put on my cute little peekaboo top. You can peekaboo as much as you like. It's up to you, boo. And, you know, just put on some cute little undergarments, but this is one of my favorite mock neck um, sweaters. So it is available over on lovedavis.com under the uh, Amore Chic tab. So I just wanted to say that out loud. I am going to also restock and put some more earrings and things up because the accessories tab is a little bit dry. I'm working on it. It'll be done. I promise it's coming. So what are we talking about today? Today... So I was in Nordstrom with my teenager and I probably already unboxed this and did like a little blurb or something over on Instagram. But I was over with my teenager in Nordstrom. She was trying to get some Toy Birch slides, her first pair. She's 19. She wants to, you know, do the mini me thing. I'm like, okay, you can save your coins, but okay, if that's what you want to do, then go ahead and do it. It's fine. Um, but she um so i of course wandered over to the perfume counter now secretly while i was over there i was trying to get some more parfums de marley's uh parfum de marley samples because i've run out of my sample set i don't have any more from the one mil or two mil whatever whatever they gave me in that discovery kit i don't have any more so i said okay you know what let me see if I can get some for my girl and maybe get a sample of, at that time I was looking at Versace Dill and Aqua because it just came out. So I'm like, let me see if I can get a couple samples for my girl that's over there. Let me see what's going on. So I ended up picking up Jimmy Choo's I Want You. Listen, I want to tell you that if you want to like just know how I really feel about it stay tuned to the end of the video my face just told you how I feel about it I absolutely love it the, the packaging is bomb it's sparkle I love the detail with the emblem this is actually um raised so you can kind of get a feel of it I just I love the packaging so what happened though is I took mine out um, and I might be have pushed down on this too hard. So this is consistently popping off. So I'm probably going to have to take mine back to Nordstrom and get a new one. But this is what the bottle looks like. It is super gorgeous. This is a 3.4 milliliter or the 100 mil. I said 3.4 milliliter. Girl, get your life together. This is the 3.4 ounces, i.e. the 100 mil bottle. The top pushes down like this. Listen. It's so good. So I don't want to spray it because I already have something else on because I'm shooting two videos today. But let me show you how it sprays. Boom. This is an absolute winner. I'll go through and tell you what it smells like, but it is an absolute winner. It is strong. It is sexy. It is for me, an all-year-round fragrance. I can tell you that automatically off the bat. It is a little powdery, but not so powdery where it's overwhelming like a Prada candy. Um, it is a bomb fragrance. Like, I love Jimmy Choo fragrances. Like, I love Jimmy Choo heels. If you're a Bigfoot girl, you got to stick with Jimmy Choo because Jimmy Choo will do your feet right. That's all I'm going to say. Get you some Jimmy Choo pumps. You'll never, ever, ever go back. You don't have to worry about the pinched toe like Aldo likes to do, even though I love my Aldo sandals. What I'm telling you is that... Jimmy Choo does a Bigfoot girl right, okay? That's all I'm gonna say. They also do fragrances right. I absolutely love this fragrance. So it has the JC right here with the gold emblem and then it has I Want You like right here. It is, oh no, 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 sorry. This says I, Jimmy Choo and you know what? I don't think it says I Want You anywhere. It doesn't. I thought that said I Want You. That says Jimmy Choo. So Jimmy Choo is right here and then there is this gold sparkle detail around here that also says Jimmy Choo. Listen, if you want his attention, 
wear it. If you want your girls to say, what in the world do you have on? Wear it. If you need a bit of confidence, a nice boost of some, some girl, you know what? You good. You got this girl. Wear it. It is that kind of fragrant fragrance very confident very smooth it, uh, if this was a drink this would be a smooth cognac okay a smooth cognac a smooth tequila a smooth it is a smooth fragrance it has long lasting ability period now that is not the word the word is longevity and siage i know the words but it has it has siage it has um it has what are you wearing what you got on? Oh, you smell good. Like, it is that type of a fragrance. You can wear it to work. You can wear it out. You can wear it, girl, you can wear this to the gym if you want to. You're going to be the best smelling thing in the gym. You can wear it wherever you want to wear it. It is an everyday fragrance, but it does pack a little bit of a punch, and it does make a statement on its own. So if you're asking, or if, you're, if you don't want to garner any attention, if you want something light, this is not it. This is a big girl heavy type of fragrance. I absolutely love this. This has such a nice individual <sighs> essence to it. The essence is hands down individual. So let me tell you what's in it. Let me tell you and I even when you when you when you first smell it, it's almost like you don't pull up any particular notes. It's just overpowering, overpowering and all around just a really good smell. It's just really, really, really a good fragrance. It doesn't, you don't get like, oh I smell this note and this note and this note. When you first smell it, it's like, damn that smell good. Like, it's that fragrance, and those are the ones that you want to get and keep. Those are the ones you want to keep consistently buying and make sure that you have in your arsenal. Those are the ones you gift other people. This is a this is a good pick-me-up. If you got a girl who's going through some things, one of your girlfriends, and they just need something, you know, when you smell good, you feel good, you know, it's, it's all about, like, having a moment. Like, just sometimes we need that in our life. This is that type of fragrance. This is a great, great, great gift. I know Mother's Day is around the corner. This is a great gift. This is really, really good. If you want to break your mama out of white diamonds, because my 92-year-old grandma, I'm sorry, she's 94. My 94-year-old love loves white diamond. I'm going to get her this because she likes to come and steal my fragrances. I'm going to just go ahead and get her this. And I'm going to get her the 3.4 ounce because she's a heavy sprayer. But with this being so strong, not like church bottom of the church purse not like church strong but a good 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 confident strong so let's talk about what's in the juice of this and if you can see look how cute and pretty the juice is it's almost rose gold it's really pretty let's talk about what's in the fragrance i should have known it's the amber floral my whole life is amber floral i, I swear to goodness my whole life is an amber floral fragrance so it is a amber floral fragrance okay just so you know so this launched, I want to say towards the end of 2020, I'm going to put this in my 2021 fragrances to launch because it really, really, really has picked up some momentum here in 2021. It is definitely a must have, a continue to have. You're going to hear a lot about this on my channel. This is probably going to fit in most of the perfume collections that I do because she is that good. But the top notes are peach and mandarin orange. I'm telling you, I can't tell you like what to pull out. I'm not getting ready to sit here and lie and say, oh, these are the notes that you're going to smell immediately. The depth of the mandarin orange, you're absolutely going to smell. The, the light, airy, fruity, strong peach is what you're going to smell, but it all comes together. It's almost like the perfect blend. You know how you get that, you know how you, have you ever gone to a restaurant and this is, this is going to be crazy, but I'm going to use this as an example just because of the ingredients that go in it. If you've ever been to a restaurant and gotten a good Long Island and you, that's the place that you go for Long Islands, then you understand what I'm saying. Long Islands have like seven alcohols in it, or maybe mine does. Maybe yours has five, but mine pretty much has seven. Long Islands have seven, about seven different types of ingredients in it, right? And if they're not perfectly blended well, what you end up with is something too strong that you can't taste um, the blend and something tastes stronger than the other, either too much tequila, too much rum, too much gin, you know, too much vodka. I might be talking about myself. Whatever the case may be. It doesn't get have a perfect blend. When I make my at-home Long Islands, it is a perfect blend. It is very hard to get that. Only a good person, a good bartender could give you that. So that's what I'm saying. This is like a perfectly blended um, fragrance where it's not like each note is layering on top of each other. They all come out equally um, important. They all equally play their role and they work together well. This is a great partnership. The fragrance notes inside of here is a great 
great, great partnership. Jimmy Choo, y'all did that. So pear, mandarin orange, jasmine, red lily, and of course, of course, of course, of course it would be the base note is vanilla. So this is a vanilla fragrance. Amber floral, it is a vanilla fragrance, but not a strong vanilla, a sexy get it together girl you got this vanilla that's what it is all right that's it that's all jimmy Choo. i want you you did that boo this is going to be a definite recommendation here on my channel you're going to see this fragrance a lot guys thank you so much for joining me for this fragrance friday if you guys are experience have any experience with jimmy Choo, if you love it you hate it tell me what you think about it leave it in the comment section below i literally want you to go and get this I will leave you a couple of links to where you can get this. I paid full price for this, but I do know that there uh, may be a, a sale or two happening. So I will consistently leave it in there. Oh, I almost forgot. Get your life together, girl. Hold on, y'all. I almost forgot. Before we end this video, let me tell you how good it is. If it's good, if it's good, then it's good, then it's good, then it's good. I added the body cream to my collection so if you guys do not know over on lovedavis.com in the love home section i do candles and body cream like a bomb body cream so this is the body cream i have new packaging for finally i have settled on packaging so this is the packaging the label it says he stole my chew let me show you what the, what it looks like this one is an empty jar because I was it's it's for picture purposes. But this is the label. It, he stole my chew. This is um it smells exactly like this. When I say exactly, it is 98% close to the scent of the designer. Okay. Let me show you what it looks like. This is what the cream looks like. This is our four ounce jar. This is what the cream looks like. This is this is what I have in my purse currently which is not Jimmy Choo's fragrance, but this is what I have in my purse currently. <sighs> Listen, it's good for you. It doesn't break you out. It goes all over your body. Now, I don't put it on my face, but I put it everywhere else. I don't have any problems. I created the perfect blend of a body cream. It is not greasy. It is not thick. It is not oily. It's not runny. It is bomb. So anyway, it has fallen so anyway you can i'll put that uh link to the body cream in the description box below if you guys pick it up i'm telling you you're gonna love it that's all i'm gonna say you're gonna love it all right guys until the next fragrance friday i will see you all soon